guys good morning how are you guys doing uh today is monday and i'm just opening up this vlog officially opening up this vlog it's weird because i usually start my vlogs on saturdays but for some reason i think starting to monday is the best now for me considering the series of events that will take place this week so it's best i start it now and yeah i have a couple of things to do today i have decided that i will take my workout seriously like my routine i have already curated it and i'm sticking by it it's just going to be very simple and basic but i'm trying to be consistent i'm trying to make sure that i continue with what i have created for myself just normal like working on the treadmill squatting i have two dumbbells each weighs five kgs do the standing dumbbell thing just to keep fit and maybe see if i'll lose one or two kgs because i don't actually want to go lower than this boy yeah my tummy i want to see if i can work on it more and look at what i eat as well i want to incorporate salad in fact i've started i've started eating loads and loads of salads and then a little bit of carb salad and enough protein that is what i'll be doing now so right now i will just go downstairs do my workout then eat and start off my day i'm going to school pick up some items and that is it basically for today so see you guys <laughs> bye guys this is what i'm eating this morning i just finished um working out nothing serious i ran on the treadmill and did like 30 squats and now this is what i'm eating it's till 12 like 12 noon and i'm just going to have this and then go about my day guys this is my full look um i'm wearing mr yogo's top <laughs> big polo i think it's from zara and then these big pants that i'm wearing is from shane and you already know my bag is from dune um I'm all dressed. When I go downstairs, I will wear my shoes. All right, guys. Talk to you guys later. Bye. guys good evening how are you guys doing you guys saw where i went to pick up my order and i want to unbox it with you guys now let me show you it's from asos and i think in here i have a lot of makeup products you know because i've run out of my products and i'm just restocking I bought a couple of things from ASOS and I'm going to show you guys the uh, things I bought. <clears throat> I love the fact that they always put this. They started this new thing. They started this this year. They always put this, I think, because of the fact that they don't want you to puncture uh any of the products in the process of opening the carton i think that's the reason and it makes sense i love it i love it so much <clears throat> and per usual they have this receipt or this document just in case i have any other products that i want to return then i can feel it i can feel the form and then send back the products to them one of the reasons i love it so i've never had to return any products but people that have returned in the past 
confirm that the procedure is very swift and straight to the point. So the products that I got, first of all, let's unbox the product that I got. They put all the beauty products in one like pack. Okay, first of all, I got this um Cantu Cantu product. It's run and the next one is from Elf. It's a powder um for setting for setting your makeup. I want to be fast. I don't want this video to be too long. <laughs> mm, okay. So see how it looks. And yeah. The next one is Huda Beauty setting powder. Yeah, they call it Easy Bake. It's in the color blondie. So I don't want to waste time. The next one is Bobbi Brown Highlight Powder. I need to open them to show you guys, but honestly, the way they package their products uh, tightly. Yeah, let me show you. This is the Bobbi Brown Highlights. I cannot wait to use this. And the next one is the Ordinary Nacinamide. This does not look like the one I have, but let me see. Nacinamide for treating my pimple. Okay, yeah. I call this liquid gold. I love it. And another one is Elmis, the collagen cleansing balm. This is very tiny. Jesus Christ. Like, this is very tiny. I didn't expect it to be this tiny. Let me know lie. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, I want to cry. Is this not too tiny? What is this? What is this? For cleaning my makeup, you know. To think that I left the, the ordinary that I usually buy because it was too small to get this one. Only for me to receive it and realize that it's equally as small as or even smaller than the ordinary. This is um a concealer in a dark shade. I brought it for my contour and maybe other things, but I know I need a dark shade of concealer and I've never used this of this product. This is my first time of ever like buying this product. I bought the elf setting powder and the lips um concealer. And I and I got the the lipsticks as well. I have to open one to show you guys the new lipsticks. I got it in two, in how many different colors? In three different colors. You see. Oh, this is Revolution, not even Elf. Yeah, Revolution. What am I saying? I love this kind of lipstick because it always doubles as like a lip gloss and a nude lipstick as well. So you can just wear it, get a brown um liner to line it, and then you are good to go. But, um, an eyeshadow, an eyeshadow palette. From Revolution. Yeah, this. package this uh, if you don't have patience you wouldn't even come down to open it you just spoil everything okay see how it looks it has all my favorite nude colors in it like with this palette you can never go wrong with the colors in this palette i love 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 them and i can't even wait to try them out they are so beautiful <laughs> oh. and, uh, done unboxing the makeup product and okay i still have a couple of makeup products here and this one let's see what this to 
to just open everything up. We need a package. Yeah. This is this is a lipstick, but I bought it like a a dark shade of lipstick from Revolution. I bought it mostly because I want to be using it as my liner, you know, like lip liner or something. I have this. And then another one. Foundation. I don't even know if I bought my exact color. This is from Elf, the foundation. I like to try out new foundations to see how they. For now, my best foundation is that Huda Beauty, the stick foundation that I got from Huda Beauty. Like, I love how it blends into my skin. If you want, you can use just a little bit of it. If you want, you can add more. If you want that, you know, makeup that like pops. So, I just love how. Ah! Okay the elf foundation and then how do you oh is it open okay, okay. let's see how it blends oh it gives skin can you guys see oh it has even disappeared into my skin Cute. I love it. And finally, I picked some pieces from ASOS. I will try them out, maybe like make a separate video where I do like a haul, like try them out, style them, and post them, post the video like differently. So, yeah, I've come to the end of this video. Uh, good night see you guys tomorrow that's if i have anything to show you guys tomorrow <laughs>
first meal of the day um moi moi you guys saw me preparing it and then a little bit of rice and the boiled egg that remained from the one i used to cook the moi moi yeah so let's dig in oh yeah <coughs> eat Check out your you know gonna audio. Mm-hmm. Easy. Good morning guys. How are you guys doing? So today is Wednesday and I'm not going to school. But I remember I told you guys that my cousin will be coming over to our place uh this week so we're going to be having family over he's coming from germany he's a priest and we have been trying to arrange a place for him to stay we don't have like an extra room one is for chimney one is my office the other one is the uh, like living room and then uh, my husband's office and our what's it called our bedroom so but yeah, Chimde does not stay in his room. Mm -hmm. So he will be the one to give up his room. He does not stay in his room. He likes to stay with us. We have been trying to arrange the room for him. We got a cushion that is collapsible into a bed. Like just a single cushion that is collapsible into a bed. Because Chimde plays around in his room and we don't want a bed here. And if we had gotten the three in one it would have been so big so this one we can just fold it back into a single armchair and keep it by the side i'll show you guys later so i'm trying to take out everything from this room like chimneys dressing like movable dressing table sorry movable dressing mat i'll take it to our room remove his pampas remove our basket and bring in a dresser a movable dresser for him because Chimdi's wardrobe is filled up. Like I can't even start removing things from there because if I remove anything from there, there is no place to put them. So I'll just bring out my dresser from my office and keep it here for him. And just buy things that will make him so comfortable here. Put a candle. Um, what else? I don't even know other things that i can put in this room then i have i have a drawing like an artwork i don't know i will not put it up like before the thing falls down and hits his head <laughs> because it will be directly under the bed like and i don't think it makes sense so that is what i'm going to be doing this morning just that like bringing in the the what's it called the dresser removing stuff removing things from Chindi's room and just making sure that it's pretty much okay right now no just to touch up okay let me show you guys how it looks for now so now this is what it looks like yeah this is the bed the collapsible bed after arranging the room i will cook today as against friday just make soup and put in the freezer because tomorrow is going to be very very hectic for me friday as well will be hectic for me so after we pick him up from from the airport i'll be going straight to school so i want to make food so that when he lands like you see something to munch on chop real nigerian <laughs> so i want to make all her soup I'll just go to the African so I think they have a day. If they don't have, I have actually, I'll mix everything up, like just improvise with what I have. But I'm making all our soup for him. And yeah, guys, all right. Bye. You guys can see my room. I'm enjoying it. Bye.
hello guys good morning how are you guys doing finally friday's here like the long awaited days here and father arrives today <laughs> my cousin is going to be touching down st today i'm so excited it's been like two years since i saw him the last time i saw him was in 2022 we traveled to germany to see him and this time around he's coming to visit us i'm so happy but unfortunately i won't even come to the airport with my husband to like pick him up because of the fact that i will be in school like i have marathon class today from morning to evening but they'll pick me up from school on their way back and also this weekend it's filled up with events like today okay father is coming today obviously it's a big event for us and tomorrow we have church after church i have a girls night as one of our friends plays like i think i love that idea of having a girls night so we are going to go there chill out and everything and sunday obviously we'll go out maybe gym display ground or just further around then monday will move again but i am so 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 happy <laughs> i'm very very happy and i'll show you guys the outcome of his room like when i showed my mom the room i was like mommy i feel like the bed is too low i feel like it's not what it i feel like like we did not do it now but my mom was like okay the bed is small true true but you have to add a table to the room you know now we've always known father to be the kind of person that loves to read like he literally raised my siblings and i so like i've known him since i was a little girl so he loves reading he's he's <laughs> if i I don't want to call him a nerd but he's very intelligent and he reads i i always wanted to be like him but i thought would so my mom was like just put a table for him in that room to augment the little bed because obviously father would not be sleeping all day that he might want to read his books he might want to like read the bible he might want to meditate so yeah uh, the table I ordered for my room for myself, fortunately enough, arrived yesterday. So it was as if everything was planned. So my husband had to just fix the table up yesterday. We usually would call someone to fix the table for us. But because this one is now very urgent, he had to take the manual, brought out all his tools and fixed everything yesterday. And it's like he did not sleep until the table was fixed. I'll show you guys. So... Yeah, I just put the things. I just hope <laughs> this place is comfortable enough for him. Well, I think it's not about the place. It's about the people, right? I know that even if we had only Matt here, he would still come and enjoy himself. He wouldn't even care. So yeah, talk to you guys later. Bye. Hello guys, good evening. Ah, it's already very dark even though it's just uh, past five. But guys, when I tell you that Lufthansa is the worst airline ever, believe me. Because see now, I have gotten the privilege to go welcome my cousin at the airport because of the fact that his flight was delayed by 45 minutes. Like. Did you even book Lufthansa if your flight wasn't delayed or anything? Like, there is no way they will not delay your flight. There is no damn way. From Germany to Estonia, it's just two hours. But they'll find a way to, <laughs> to still delay the flight. So, yeah. Thank God I was fortunate enough. The delay helped my life. Now we are driving to the airport to go welcome him. Um, okay guys, bye! Which one?
give him front doors. Front right. Oh, see. Thank you. He brought this for Chimdi. This is the best gift ever. Oh my god. Oh father, thank you so much. Ah. Thank you. Good morning. I just finished doing my morning workout routine now, and it's Saturday morning, by the way. I uh, will just go take my bed and then I start my day. I told you guys that I curated a workout routine for myself, it's nothing serious. Um, I squat for now 30 squats, um, work on the treadmill, run on the treadmill for 30 minutes. Um, um using my what's it called using my dumbbells two of them they are they weigh five kg each for my arms just like not too serious but i love it i love how i've been feeling it's not been easy i started it like um last week ending so this is like my eighth day doing the workout and now I no longer feel the pain on my towels. Everywhere has gotten used to the whole, every part of my body is now sensitized to my routine. So like I've gotten myself back and I can do this. I know I just need discipline and consistency, but I can do this. Let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. I'm just, I try as much as I can to get pictures. Not every day though, maybe I try as much as possible to see if I can keep pictures in order to be able to compare my progress. All right, guys. Talk to you guys later. Bye.
What the work I am, you made the whole work. <laughs> Little human being. <laughs> Hello, guys. Good afternoon. I'm going out. My cousin and I are going now. Convinced him to take me to the local market, and yeah, we're driving out together. Yes, <laughs> saving memories. We're going to buy food stuff for tomorrow being Sunday. So yeah, nothing serious. I'm wearing this jalabi that I got from Judy in 2021. And my glasses because it's quite sunny today but very cold. My hat and my bag, my errand bag and my water. Talk to you guys soon. We're going out. I'm so, so happy creating this moment. What I love about recording moments of my life is that I get to watch them over and over and over again anytime I want. And they kind of just make me feel good. Like my cousin is only going to be here for a couple of days, but these memories are going to last forever. You get? The cow and what put that out no mob. The rich each other. Hey, this one will be too much. Because I'm good at your skin shall shine. Oh, bravo! Hey, go on, you're ready. Of course, an imperfection on your skin. Nothing at all. Um, um, does it come with age? Mommy of new with pimples and everything, but now where was it? How are you guys doing and happy sunday so this video is to explain the series of events that we follow up next like the videos that you post at uh, this video you explain them because i did not remember to carry you guys along i was just recording randomly so first of all i remember i told you guys i was going to the market with my cousin the local market there i was not able to record anything in fact i totally forgot because i was busy enjoying the moments that i did not even remember to record and after that we got home and then dressed up and headed to church immediately so um i know you guys i i told you guys my cousin is a priest so he delivered the homely at church but again i did not record <laughs> i forgot but i think i got like a 10 second clip that i would just attach then um, what else after that i went straight to the girls night out i told you guys about and i had a lot of fun we had fun i did to my satisfaction seafood boy <laughs> i will attach the videos after this very explanation so yeah today is sunday oh yeah we have um plans of going out i don't know we are still contemplating whether or not to go bowling it's been a busy but eventful couple of days and i i love i love love it we don't get to have family over all the time so when you do you try to enjoy every moment that comes with the gathering um, just soaking everything soaking the love the happiness the joy random conversations and also 
um yeah talk to you guys later <laughs> Already shine. I cannot wait. We are here for a girls' night, and Queen is preparing seafood boy for us. I cannot wait. This is beautiful. Is <laughs> the description for me? Chicken wings. This is not hot chicken wings, right?